Beloved friends of light, welcome by Universal Minister of Divine Love. Welcome by our YouTube channel, 365 Days with our beloved Mother Mary. I'm Reverend Marie Petrovska, and I greet you today to our day 66 of our 365 days along the down. Beloved Heart of Light, I greet you again. And on this day, I would like to remind you that we have already passed the first 65 days of 365 days of our vigil. This is a very important turning point on our journey. Today, 300 days are right before us on a pilgrimage to the Immaculate Heart of Mary. I'm here to remind you that we are going forward with our prayers no matter what. 300 videos of our journey will be posted on this YouTube channel. I can promise you that all the series will be posted every day. But I would like to invite you today to make a new start on our everyday vigil. I invite all of you who are following our vigil, who just found this YouTube channel, and who would like to recite the prayers of Blessed Mother Mary with us during one year. I invite all of you to start with our day one and continue to watch every day new following video of the day two, three, four, five, and so on. At the same time, I will recite the same prayers with you, Blessed Hearts, and I will continue to post new videos so that our video will continue today. You are watching day 66, and I invite you also to watch video of the day number one. So, that our intensity to continue our video as Mother Mary's uh, prayers will be done really every day because all 65 or really 66 videos are already posted on YouTube channel. You will miss no any day and we will continue to go through this video listening again to these blessed messages of Mother Mary and we will continue with our devotion. So, in the meanwhile, I will have a little bit more time to come up with the new videos. So, my dear hearts, let's reinforce our spiral of devotion by starting today, just on the day when you watch this video, just start right now, by coming back to our video of the day number one and continue all the following days with uh, the next days. I will do the same thing with you. My dearest hearts, this month of the year, this harvest time of the year, the months of September, October, November and December are incredibly important. In the situations that we do have right now on our planet, our devotion is absolutely paramount for keeping the balance of light for the Earth's evolutions. So that I really want to increase again our devotion to Blessed Mother Mary by making this restart in uh, the month September and going on in September, October, November and December with missing no any day until the December 31 at the end of the year 2020. Please understand, to keep the vigil, the Blessed Mother Mary is absolutely essential for the great plan of our Blessed Father and Mother in Heaven for the salvation of the Earth's evolutions. I will tell you a little bit more again and again in the next videos what is really going on in our planet right now. Probably you know it this already on yourself. We will see uh, unpredictable things coming in this 
uh, end of this year. And so let's be prepared for everything that we even can't imagine can happen. Let's keep our vision on the positive things. Let's keep our vision on the ultimate victory of the forces of light. Our blessed Archangels are here. Our blessed Savior Yahushua HaMashiach is here. Our blessed Mother Mary is here too with her blessed angelic legions. And as you remember, we also are angels and incarnation ready here to support our blessed Virgin in this tremendous success of the divine plan or the salvation of the evolutions. So, blessed hearts, please stay on fire, stay inspired, stay awake, stay active in your spiritual work, in your service to mankind. Let's connect once more to each other. Let's connect our hearts to each other, to all the souls of light following 365 days which of the Blessed Mother Mary. Let's remember that we are all together in this uh, phenomenal battle of light. We are here really to make a difference on our planet Earth, my blessed friend of light. So let's go on and on with our vigil, no matter what. Don't forget, if you have a little bit more time, to recite our Father Prayer nine times every day and to recite Hail Mary's 33 days every day. So make your service to Mother Mary's Immaculate Heart the priority and the end of this year so that we all together will really see magnanimous victory of the light appearing in this Christmas season where we will be a part of the tremendous victory of light on this planet. So every voice counts, every heartbeat counts. Please be here with me in this battle of light be here every day and know that Mother Mary has a great reward for you, blessed hearts. At the most difficult moments of our times, she will be here for us, reaching out and keeping balance for us personally, because we truly held balance for her blessed children worldwide. So, my dear hearts, let's take a deep breath right now Breathe slowly out. Let us place our hands upon our chest. And let's make this inner pledge to be here for Mother Mary and her blessed Son, for our blessed Father and Mother in Heaven, for the coming days in this four month of the year. And of course, we will continue with our vigil and the year 2021-2. Let's start now with our Father prayer. Many blessings to all of you from my heart. Let's remember that our love is absolutely immortal. It is the greatest power in this universe that we truly will change the direction of the history on our planet. I love you, I thank you, and I bless you. Our Father prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, I am. I am thy kingdom come. I am thy will being done. I am on earth, even as I am in heaven. I am giving this day daily bread to all. I am forgiving all life this day, even as I am also all life forgiving. I am leading all men away from temptation. I am delivering all men from every evil condition. 
I am the kingdom, I am the power, and I am the glory of Yahweh in eternal, immortal manifestation. All this I am. O Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, I am. I am thy kingdom come. I am thy will being done. I am on earth, even as I am in heaven. I am giving this day daily bread to all. I am forgiving all life this day, even as I am also all life forgiving. I am leading all men away from temptation. I am delivering all men from every evil condition. I am the kingdom. I am the power, and I am the glory of Yahweh in eternal, immortal manifestation. All this I am. O oh, Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, I am. I am thy kingdom come. I am thy will being done. I am on earth, even as I am in heaven. I am giving this day daily bread to all. I am forgiving all life this day, even as I am also all life forgiving. I am leading all men away from temptation. I am delivering all men from every evil condition. I am the kingdom, I am the power, and I am the glory of Yahweh in eternal, immortal manifestation. All this I am. Let's recite now our Hail Marys. Hail Mary, full of grace, Yahweh is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Yahushua. Holy Mary, Mother of our Savior, pray for us, sons and daughters of Yahweh, now and at the hour of our victory over sin, disease, and death. Hail Mary, full of grace, Yahweh is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Yahshua. Holy Mary, Mother of our Savior, pray for us, sons and daughters of Yahweh, now and at the hour of our victory over sin disease and death. Hail Mary, full of grace, Yahweh is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Yahushua. Holy Mary, Mother of our Savior, pray for us, sons and daughters of Yahweh, now and at the hour of our victory, over sin, disease, and death. Amen. Act of consecration over your soul to the Immaculate Heart of Mother Mary. O Blessed Mary, 
Virgin most powerful, and Mother of Mercy, Queen of the Angels, a refuge of all children of Yahweh. We consecrate ourselves to your Immaculate Heart. We consecrate to you our very being and our whole life, all that we have, all that we love, all that we are. To you we give our bodies, our hearts, and our souls. To your Immaculate Heart, we consecrate our homes, our families, our countries, and our beloved planet. We desire that all that is in us and around us may belong to you and may share the benefits of your motherly benediction. And may this act of consecration of our souls, to your Immaculate Heart, may be truly everlasting. We renew this day at your feet the secret promises of our baptism and our first Holy Communion. We pledge ourselves to profess courageously the truth of our holy faith in the law of the One, our blessed Yahweh. I am that I am and to live our lives as the true children of our Father and Mother in Heaven, who are submissive to all directions of the living Christ. We pledge ourselves to keep the commandments of El Shaddai and to devote ourselves wholeheartedly to your service, Blessed Mother Mary. Use us, beloved Mother. Release your blessings to this world through us and help us to heal to teach, to support, to guide, blessed children of Yahweh, to the deepest union with the One through your Immaculate Heart. We proclaim the coming of the Kingdom of your adorable Son, Yahushua HaMashiach, in the inner temples of our hearts, in the beating heart of all creation. We proclaim the living presence of the Christ shining brightly in the secret core of every family, every country, and through the whole world, as above, so below, as in heaven, so on earth. Amen. Prayer to Mother Mary to save all children. O Blessed Virgin Mary, Queen of Heaven and Earth, to Thy Immaculate Heart, the channel of all graces, we pray for all children worldwide. In the name of the Most Holy One, I am that I am. We consecrate every living child on our planet to your Immaculate Heart. We bring them all to you, Blessed Mother Mary. We place the precious souls in your loving hands, and we ask you to be the comforting and protecting Mother to all little ones on our planet. May the Shekinah of Divine Glory the everlasting mantle of light of Cosmic Virgin, covered now with the invincible shield of protection every child on earth. O Holy Mother, we raise up our voices and we plead you from the bottom of our hearts to seal all children on earth, included the unborn in your immaculate heart. Truly your heart is divine source of goodness that never fails to love, to protect, to heal, and to guide. Seal the little ones on our planet from the wicked satanic forces. Bind the evil at the core of the perverted nature. Paralyze the dark forces wherever they are and the intentions to destroy 
the secret innocence, holiness, and purity of children of Yahweh. O Blessed Mother of Salvation, save the lives and the souls of all children on our planet. May your loving maternal protection save them forever from all danger. Keep all children protected from abduction, sexual perversion and abuse, murder and satanic sacrifice. May all children on our planet find their refuge in your immaculate heart that as an invincible wall of protection surrounds every born and unborn child in this world. May they be protected from all sin. May their virtues and talents expand through your nourishing love. May they grow daily in wisdom and grace. May the core of all goodness that beloved Yahweh have placed in the hearts and the moment of birth shine forth day and night and expand more and more. Beloved Mother of Salvation, present every living child on earth to thy divine Son, Yahushua, for his ultimate blessing of soul's recovering and resurrection. Wash all sorrow and pain, and take away any remembrance of committed misdeeds from their souls. Heal their soul wounds, and make them all whole again. May no one of them perish, but know the everlasting life and love of our Creator. May their souls, minds, and bodies be saved. May they go through life, strengthened by your personal guidance and presence. May the Eternal Father always look upon them with delight, and see in them the reflection of thy immaculate beauty. May the joy of eternal life in Christ never leave the souls, no matter what can happen on the way. May the right hand of Yahweh and the right hand of the Cosmic Virgin remain above the head of every child on earth. And may the presence of Yahweh at the sight of every child block any evil intention against them and so it will be by the holy grace of the almighty one and divine intercession of our blessed mother mary amen My dear child, may the clear waters of immortal life from our Father's kingdom wash your soul clean again and again. Forget your past. Forget your sorrow. Forget the failures of your soul. May the waterfalls of the crystal pure light descend and purge you with the ultimate joy of our Creator again and again. There is no one in heaven among the angelic and cosmic beings of light who will condemn you for the wrong choices that you have ever made on your path. You, and not our Father in Heaven, are your greatest judge, my blessed friend of light. It is your own sense of self-condemnation and self-judgment that blocks your infinite joy and freedom more than anything else in this world. 
beloved heart. May you always remember that our Father has sent you here for a very special purpose. And this purpose is the discovery through your long life journey of who you really are. And who are you, beloved? Have you already found the answer to this question? I really hope that you know what is your nature and where you belong to. My dear child, it is our Father's longing to see you walking your path with a complete awareness of who you really are. The Christ child of flesh and blood with an infinite divine potential of becoming a king of this universe. You are the child of the Most High the great divine spiritual being that continues to move on through the limitations of time and space. You are a celestial soul from heaven that came to earth to discover the impermanent nature of human longings, human thoughts and feelings. May I remind you, dear one, that you were never asked by your father to be a perfect human being. Truly, you don't need to be perfect, only to be real. There is not such a thing as human perfection, my dear heart. You must know that perfection is the divine aspect of the Christ that is real in you. Be real then, blessed child of the Almighty One. Strive to live your life as a Christ at one. But never forget that you are dealing daily with your own human creation, which is vulnerable impermanent and never perfect by nature. I ask you to call daily to the secret heart of Yahweh. Just ask your Father to continue to release the waves of the cosmic Christ perfection into your world at any moment of your life. You need to know, beloved, that when the Christ in you will finally take full command over your human mind, your thoughts, your human emotions and deeds, you will definitely become a master of your world. When the Christ in you will become your only reality, you will automatically be transformed into a pure vessel of divine perfection of our Father which is in heaven. I love you dearly and I see the Christ in you. Amen.